South Africa's bid to host the Rugby World Cup in 2023 is promising record profits. They're convinced it would be a success. According to an economic assessment report commissioned by SA Rugby, projections indicate the tournament could bring $2 billion direct and indirect economic impact to South Africa, and close to $380 million of that would flow into low-income households. 39,000 temporary and permanent jobs would be sustained, and $150 million in tax benefits would go to government. Saro says a South African Rugby World Cup would be an unbeatable triple win for the sport, supporters and players. CEO of SA Rugby, Yuri Ru, believes South Africa ticks every single box of the financial, commercial and logistical requirements of the host. And with a soundtrack record of both 1995 Rugby World Cup and 2010 Football World Cup, the country believes it can do it due to existing infrastructure and know-how. But South Africa's political instability magnified since the government withdrew support for Durban's 2022 Commonwealth Games bid could be its weak link. And Saro will have to convince international rugby why South Africa should play host again. The winners in 1995 and 2007, the Springboks are once again dreaming of Rugby World Cup victory and of hopefully doing it on home soil. The winning bidder needs 20 votes out of a total of 39 and the 2023 World Cup Rugby will be decided on the 15th of November. Julie Shara, CGTN, Johannesburg, South Africa.